Welcome back to our channel. In this video, I'll be sharing a rapture dream experienced by one of our brothers in Christ. As always, you can find the link to his original video in the description below. For now, let's dive in and explore this incredible dream together. What's going on, guys? I was led by the Lord to share my rapture dream. And why not? Let's just get into it. In Jesus' name, God, touch whoever is meant to be touched and let your will be done and your glory proclaimed in the mighty name of Jesus. Hallelujah. So I had this dream like four years ago and it was one of the most intense dreams I've ever had in my entire life. And I will describe it to the best of my ability to how I recall it. I was four years ago staying in a homeless shelter and I'm staying in one now. But I had a dream where in the dream, I was brought up to a white bright realm. And there was two angels standing before me. And one of the angels on the right side was looking at me and he had like platinum diamond armor on. It was literally all over him from head to toe. And there, then there was an angel right beside him. And he had gold armor on from head to toe. And this angel was standing right beside this other angel with diamond all over his, his armor. And they both were just looking at me, these huge, tall angels, so tall. And I have no idea what's happening. And they don't say a word. And they're just looking at me and I'm looking at them. I'm like, okay. Fast forward, the next thing you know, in the dream, Jesus appears in the sky and the whole kingdom is right behind him. And all I can see of Jesus is this white, just pure angelic energy riding on a horse into battle in the middle of the air. And the whole kingdom of heaven was behind him. And across from Jesus, as he was riding across the sky into battle, was literally rows of people just with him right behind him different houses of God and different spirits of God were there and fighting with the Lord. Everyone was there. It was game time. And as Jesus is riding us into battle through the sky, we're all riding right behind him too, right out to these demons, all these skeletons, all these goblins, all these just demonic manifestations just start coming out of the sky towards us and the whole kingdom where Jesus is. And I was on the right side of Jesus a little bit to his right. And, and I don't know why I was up at the front, but in the dream, I was at the front of the battle. And we're running, we're, we're literally running into the air, into battle to fight. And there's, again, all these like satanic spawns are coming, skeletons, uh, grim reapers, demons, shadows, like anything you could, anything you could really imagine that could be a spawn of Satan or something demonic, it was there. And it was fighting um, and it was coming from the other side of the sky where Christ and uh, the whole kingdom was fighting this way and they were coming at us and it was like a video game every time that one of the people died in battle on the side of God literally respawned back in and kept fighting on until every last one of those demons was completely destroyed Every time one of us got hit, I remember I got hit in a dream and I respawned in the air back in with like a sword and like, like a video game, like, like nothing happened. And that's what was happening to the whole kingdom of heaven. The devil and all his demons couldn't destroy a single one of us. We just simply spawned back in like the Lord himself was keeping us in his spirit, in his power, super powerful stuff. And as all these spawns of Satan are being destroyed, as this whole kingdom of darkness that's coming at us is being destroyed by the kingdom of heaven, as we're riding out into the battle, the whole earth crumbles into just straight molten lava, fire. And from the very center of the core of the earth, as this is all going on, snake, Satan, 
such a big snake, the biggest snake you could ever imagine. Like imagine a snake as big as like this earth. Like you see me down here on the sky, imagine a snake like literally the size of like, like Godzilla kind of style snake. And it was Satan. And he was at the very end of where we were. And all the skeletons, all the Grim Reapers, all the stuff were coming out and attacking us from his end. And he was the like final boss. This big, huge red snake that came out, that came out of the earth. The earth literally crumbled in the air and there was nothing but fire left. And Satan came right out of the center of that fire. And as we're getting through, we're cutting through every last demon, every last Grim Reaper, every last giant shadow, whatever you name it, it was getting destroyed. Everything was getting slaughtered. And then the last being that was without slay, was satan was the snake and once we got to satan in the dream jesus literally rode right into the heart like right into the center of the snake rode right into it with all of us right behind him and the battle was over the battle was over and i remember in the dream as we went plummeting into the heart of satan there was peace everywhere. It was almost as if there was nothing. There was just peace. Like all darkness in existence was completely destroyed and no longer existed. Like all there was, was God in his power in the heavenly realms. And I still meditate on this dream. And after there was silence and after the war was fought, I woke up. And I was just in shock to have this dream, to see all these details. I didn't even ask for a rapture dream too. I know a lot of people are getting them and asking for dreams. But this dream was by far one of the deepest dreams I've ever had in my entire life. I've waited four years to tell the story. It was a crazy dream. Just to recap, I believe that those two angels in the beginning of the dream were Michael and Gabriel, the war angels, the archangels. I'm not sure how they're described in the Bible, but I'm sure it's something amongst the lines of what I saw. And then the second after I saw Michael and and uh, Gabriel, I believe, we all were riding in the sky with Christ and, and the battle was won. <laughs> and I just wanna share this to encourage anybody, you know, the battle has been won in Jesus Christ alone. Don't be afraid about going to hell. No, Jesus loves you, man. And he's won this battle. He's literally destroyed Satan and there's millions of people who can testify to this. There's so many people who are having visions, rapture dreams, uh, stuff going on. So I really do hope this helps somebody. If you took anything from this, I really hope that by the power of my testimony and the blood of Jesus Christ, that it would plant seeds into the non-believers watching and the people who are in the faith, that it would light a fire in you to continue to share the glory of God every moment possible. For this time is short for the coming of our Father. In Jesus' name I pray. Amen. I love y'all. Be blessed and encouraged and continue to bear fruit with repentance for the kingdom is at hand. God bless y'all and have a good night.